What's up everybody, Tactical Production 7 here, back to the Minecraft mod tutorial. Today, the mod tutorial will be on the Advanced Hood mod, and what this mod does is it adds customization to um, your Minecraft hood, so you can disable things in it, you can um, uh, reposition them, and it just works out really well, say if you're going to like record something and you don't want certain things showing up, um, but you don't want everything to disappear. So if you don't know what your hood is, this down here is your hood. Um, so basically your armor, your health, your hunger, the XP bar, and your items list. That is your hood. So when you have advanced hood installed, what you do is you hit H and it will bring up the hood settings menu. You hit back to game, of course you go back to playing Minecraft. And first off you have your cursor and you can go ahead and disable that. And if you disable it, you'll notice down here that your cursor disappears. Re-enable it and it's back. So I don't want that to be there, so I'm going to take that off. And then we have our health bar, and again, you can disable it, and you see it disappears. And then you re-enable it. And uh, you can reposition things, as I had said. So I'm going to try to stack everything up over here. And then we hit back, and we got the armor bar. So let's go ahead and reposition that as well. Try to get it lined up. There we go now we have our hunger bar and there's the um, this is the only known bug for this mod as of right now you can see that the hunger bar is glitched out and it acts as if you are um, out of hunger and you're about to it acts like when you um, are hungry and you're starting to die but uh, I have full hunger so so let's reposition that um, let's see Let's take our breath bar. We could probably just put the breath bar. Um, when you don't have it on there, it'll just be a brown, uh, black box like this. Since we can't see the breath bar because I'm not underwater, I'll just set it right there. And we'll hit back uh, the XP bar. Let's go ahead and reposition that to be down here. And we'll hit back and the level counter we'll reposition that that is um, the thing that says two basically tells you what level you're on and the item bar let's go ahead and reposition that and just bring it up here if we can um, I don't want it to cover up that, which I think it's going to. So once you have all that done, just go ahead and hit back to game. And there you go, it's all reset. Um, I think it would be cool if you could make it to where uh, you could layer different things. So as you see that the um, XP is at 2, but it's behind the item bar. That would be cool if you could maybe make it to where the XP bar um, or XP counter is in front of the item bar. I think that would look really cool just like this setup right here but as I said you can disable everything so nothing shows up or only certain things show up so very simple mod but very effective if you need it to uh, like I said say if you're gonna record or something and you make things disappear that you don't want to show up so that is what the mod does I now need to clean out my minecraft jar after I do that I'll be back and I'll show you how to install this mod Okay, so what you're going to need to install this is some sort of archiving program such as WinRAR, 7-Zip, or WinZip. Um, you could use whatever archiving program you want. They all work the same, but I will be using WinRAR in this tutorial. Then what you're going to need to download is the Advanced Hood mod itself. Now, that is all you're going to need to download to install this mod. Um, you don't need Mod Loader or any of that sort of stuff, so this installation will be very simple and easy. So I will go ahead and give you the link to this page in the description to download the Advanced Hood mod. And if you go ahead and scroll down, here's some of the features it tells you, and just some screenshots. But you want to scroll down to where you see download, and just go ahead and click on download. And it'll take you to a media fire link, and you just go ahead and click on download to download the mod. Now, when you have it out on your desktop, and you're ready to install it, go ahead and come over to start. Type in percent app data percent, just like this down here. And go into your roaming. 
then go into your dot minecraft then open up your bin then you're going to want to left click your minecraft jar then right click it and do open with whatever archiving program you're using like I said I'm using WinRAR so I'm going to go ahead and open it up with WinRAR drag your minecraft jar to the side you can go ahead and close your bin we don't need this anymore so once you have your Minecraft jar open, go ahead and open up the advanced hood mod, highlight all these class files, and drag it into your Minecraft jar, and hit OK. So you can go ahead and close the advanced hood mod. Now in your Minecraft jar, you should see a folder named MetaInf. If you don't see this, then you can go ahead and skip this step. But if you do see it, go ahead and left click it, then right click it, and do delete files, and hit yes. And that will delete MetaInf. Um, you always want to do that. Uh, if you're installing a mod because if you don't it will stop Minecraft from working and it'll give you a black screen So that's it you can go ahead and close your Minecraft jar and hop into Minecraft and mess around with this mod Like I said very simple installation probably one of the easiest things to install um, So yeah, hope this video helped you guys out. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time